Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss a small problem based on preparation of ethers. So the question that is asked here is that we need to give the chemical reaction involved in the preparation of third butyl ethyl ether using Williamson method. So in order to solve this problem, the first thing that we need to do is to draw the structure of the ether. So the structure of ether which is third butyl ethyl ether is given here. You can see that this is the third butyl group and this is the ethyl group and this is the structure of a ether. Now this ether can be prepared via two methods that is by using this as an alkyl halide and this as an alkoxide ion or by using this part as alkoxide ion and this as an alkyl halide. Let us try to understand what will be the products obtained in each of those cases. So in the first case we are taking ethyl bromide as an alkyl halide and third butoxide ion as an attacking species. So if we do that we can see that the nucleophile here is third butoxide ion will attack the primary alkyl halide CH3 CH2 Br is a primary alkyl halide to give us third butyl ethyl ether which is our desired product. So you can see that here we have used a primary alkyl halide and a tertiary alkoxide ion. Now in the second case we can see that we have employed a tertiary alkyl halide and ethoxide ion as a alkoxide ion. So here we can see that the alkoxide ion now acts as a base and not a nucleophile and abstracts hydrogen atom resulting in the formation of an alkene and here we do not end up getting an ether. This is mainly because our substrate or the alkyl halide is tertiary and is highly sterically hindered for the ethoxide ion to attack the CBr bond and result in substitution. Therefore, the same alkoxide ion now acts as a base and abstract hydrogen atom resulting in the formation of an alkene. So this problem again stresses the importance of using primary alkyl halide as a substrate and secondary or tertiary alkoxide ion as the attacking species. I hope you are very clear on how we have arrived at this particular solution. Thank you.